hello, hello, Tanya's Tarot. And thank you guys. We're going to do a quick check-in and see what you need to know right now for your grace and how it's good. If you're new here, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back, babies. Okay? All my information is down below in the description box. If you'd like to book, buy, leave a tip or donation. Don't forget to like, comment, or share this video. Name the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. Thank you, guys. What does the collective need to know right now? What the grace and highest good? Three cards for it. One, two. Oh, that's the three. Okay, so then I can just did this read. <laughs> okay, so a personal issue reaches resolution for you guys. It's coming in quickly. Spirit says it's time for you to take action right now. And it's a time to give rather than to take. Okay, Spirit also wants you to know that luck is on your side at this time, collective. So let's jump into this and see what's going on. Whatever personal issues you may have been having that is coming to an end, it's time to step out and take action. And it's better to, to be of service than to take right now, okay? Now is the time to give. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Clarify personal issue reaches resolution for the collective. Thank you. Okay, so somebody wanted to return from the past, but they're not returning. Are you are waiting for somebody to return from the past and they haven't returned? They've been holding back here. Tell me more spirit. Yeah, so this person is not happy right now. Could be an Aquarius, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. This person is all up in their head at this time because they possibly thought you were going to return, that you were going to come back, that they were going to be able to heal the situation, and they have not been able to. Whatever was holding them back from returning and from healing has had them all up in their head. Tell me more about the personal issue here, Spirit. Yeah, now this person, this person could have been hiding the fact that there was some type of third-party situation going on. This third-party situation has now come to an end. And this person is transforming the situation. Now they're going to come towards you to take action here. To a paper. This person is no longer juggling. So whatever third party situation that was going on. This person is no longer in that third party situation. They have ended it. You possibly didn't even know there was a third party situation. But this is what was keeping this person from returning. Okay. Now this person has ended it and they're transformed. They're coming back to you. They're no longer juggling. They want to put the action in. Yeah, this person sees you as their wish fulfillment here. But they're all up in their head. Yep. They're all up in their head about moving away from emotional conflict and moving towards something peaceful here. But they're going to take the action. Yeah, because they want to heal from this heartbreak. This is what is keeping them or has them crossed about coming in. They could have broke your heart. Okay. They could have broke your heart and, and they're trying to figure out how to come towards you. But they want to move away from this emotional conflict. They want to move towards something peaceful here. This is why they're all up in their head. They're overthinking. You could have blocked this person out as well. And they're trying to figure out how to get back in. Because they see you as their wish fulfillment. And they're no longer juggling. Tell me more about this time to take action. Yeah, there was some type of lying, sneaking, deceptiveness in the past. And this is why they're in their head. But they see you as the Ten of Pentacles. This person wants to come in. They want to build with you. They see long-term, stable, committed relationship here with you. Tell me about a time to give rather than to take. So this person wants to come in now and they want to give to you. This person is willing to fight for this con connection. Tell me more, Spirit. Yeah, they want to come in. They want to have some type of conversation. They want to come in quickly and communicate. Tell me more about a time to give rather than take. 
Is this person just trying to manifest this new beginning here? They no longer want to be left out in the cold. They want to return. Yep, eight of one. I mean, eight of cups in in reverse. They want to return, and they they're willing to fight for this situation, for this connection here. Tell me more, spirit. Yeah, so this person is sitting back watching, waiting for the right moment to come in. They're getting their shit together so they can come towards you here, collective. Yep, because they want to come in and make you this offer here, this page of cups. They want to apologize. They want to express their love. They see victory and success here with you. This person wants to heal. They're getting their strength together to come in to offer you this passionate new beginning. Anything else here for my collective? Remember, luck is on your side, babies. If this person is obsessing over this connection between the two of you, whatever addictions or whatever um, was holding this person back, whatever had this person bound and stuck, they are no longer bound and stuck. They have dropped that. They have healed it. They have released it. Yep, and they're coming towards you. They're hoping that um, judgment is in their favor. Yep, and they're going to come in as the King of Swords and talk to you about this. They want to clarify, yeah, because they see you as the Queen of Swords, as their soulmate, as their divine partner here, as a wife here. And they hope that luck is on their side when they then when they come towards you. Will of Fortune. Okay, guys, so I'm going to leave this here. If it resonated with you, let me know down in the comments section. Until next time, babies, you keep rocking with me. I'm going to keep rocking with you. Love, light, and peace. Mwah! Bye, TTs, babies.